We live in a world full of distractions. Social media, notifications, and constant emails. Everyone's trying to pull your attention. And all that noise is dragging you away from what truly matters, your goals. You only have three months left of the year. So what do you want to show for it? Excuses, little to no results? Go ghost mode for the next three months. It's a no-nonsense way to block out the noise and get focused towards what actually matters. It's not about disappearing off the face of the earth. It's about stepping back cutting out the nonsense and putting yourself first. So if you're ready to stop playing small and become that unstoppable version of yourself, I made it easy for you. Here's the six steps that will help you go ghost mode and level up your life. First, define your goals. Before you go ghost mode, you need to know why you're doing it. What are you grinding for? Better shape, better mindset, better relationship, bigger house, faster car, what is the actual goal you want to achieve? And whatever it is, whatever the goal actually is, you got to get clear on it, crystal clear, because that clarity is your compass. And without it, you're just going to be wandering. Think about it like this. You want to travel across the country. Well, there's probably a city you specifically want to go to. You're not just going to get in your car and start driving because most of you don't even understand where North, South, East, and West are. So if you just do that, you're going to end up either at the North Pole, the border, in an ocean, or in a city that you've never been before. So you gotta open up your maps, type in the destination, and start following the cues. It's the exact same when it comes to your goals. Second, digital detox. You guys are way too addicted to this thing. And yes, it can motivate you and inspire you and give you a lot of resources to transform your life, but it could also be your downfall. And it is for a lot of you. You guys are too addicted to Instagram and TikTok and Facebook and YouTube, so you just kill time. Go to your screen time on your phone right now and audit how much time you are wasting on a daily basis. All that time could be spent working towards your goals, bettering your body, and so on. So either delete the app so you are not pressured or called to go spend time on them, or at least just get off the phone in general. Set hours for yourself where you don't check it. Detox from the phone itself. Third, Practice self-care like a savage. In order to become the best version of yourself, you need to take care of self. And that means you shouldn't be grinding 24-7. I'm all about the grind, trust me. I get the mentality and I get the want to push because you think hard work is the only thing that's gonna get you to success. But if you do not take a step back from time to time and get the massages and prioritize your sleep and focus on what you are putting in your body nutrition-wise, you will not get to that end goal. So yes, train your ass off in the gym, push yourself on a daily basis, mentally, physically, and emotionally, but also give back to self. I don't go a week without Cairo, massage, and other things to give back to my body so I can play at the highest level and neither should you. Four is create a ruthless routine. Your calendar should be your Bible. It should be your guide and you should go off of it every single day. You should do the same thing every day because attacking life willy nilly, trying to do different stuff is only going to burn you out with decision fatigue. A routine removes that. A routine helps you see success in all areas of life that matter mental, physical, emotional, and financial. So block out times in your calendar to work towards your fitness goals, your mindset goals, your relationship goals, and your wealth goals, because that will guarantee your success. Five, learn like your life depends on it. You see, going ghost mode is about disconnecting from the distractions. It is not about turning off the world and doing nothing. So during ghost mode, during that time, you should be absorbing, taking in information that is going to push the needle forward in all areas of life that you would like to grow. Six is about reflecting and adjusting. I do this every single Sunday. I have a two hour block where I reflect on the previous week. How did my content do? How are my workouts? Did I have a date night with my wife? Did I grow as an individual? All right, reflecting on the past and seeing what you did right and wrong will help you grow towards becoming the person you would like to be. If you don't ever look backwards and make subtle adjustments, you can never expect to become that person. So look back and make the necessary moves. Going ghost, going ghost mode, embracing ghost mode is about focusing on yourself in the most extreme way possible. It's about shutting out the world's noise and doing what is necessary based off of what your needs are. It's not just another phase, it's a transformation with no BS and no excuses. So go ghost for the next three months and step into the shoes you actually wanna wear. Hit that subscribe button, turn on the notification bell, and stay tuned for more content to help you up-level your life.